Oh, he's back. Hot 106.7's Joe Breezy is in the house and checking out what's hot this weekend. Uh-huh. And per usual, there's a lot going on, so break it down for us. As they should. It's Music City. Let's make yes. it happen. Yes. Uh, let's start things off by talking about tonight because Downtown Nashville's Songwriter Showcase is popping off uh, at the Copper Branch right there on Church Street. We love Copper Branch. Yes. Right? It starts, right, starts at 5 o'clock. That'll be really cool. And it's just a really cool, fun way to celebrate what, what makes Nashville you know, just special with the yes. songwriting community mm -hmm. and you just go in there and you meet other creative types and all that. The so stories, all the things kind of campfire style, mm -hmm. which is very cool. And the food is great. And speaking <laughs> of food, yeah, tomorrow, uh, the third annual clean foodie fest is going Ooh, down. How neat right. is this? It's the first time right. I've actually learned about this. So I'm excited to check this out. Starts at 9 a.m. Uh, goes to one o'clock is at the Hilton Garden. It's actually in Smyrna mm -hmm. and we're talking like Clean eats, drinks, treats, home goods, totally family friendly, like five or ten bucks, and 12 and under get in for free. So Ooh, definitely check that I out as well. I want to check that out for sure. Yeah. yeah. Uh, turning things over to sports. Yay, sports. Woo. Uh, go Preds. Let's talk about it. They're taking hey. on the Sabres tomorrow night at Bridgestone. Puck Have drops fun. at 7 o'clock. We do have a winning record against Sabres all time, so we definitely want to keep that going and stay in that winning lane, you know? Go Preds. Uh, Sunday, the Nashville Symphony. How cool is this? I'm totally nerding out about this. The music of Star Wars. That's going to be cool. <laughs> Ooh, that will be moving. <laughs> Absolutely. Legit, right? Um, also, a handmade pasta cooking experience is going on at the Chef and I right there in the Gulch. Oh. That starts at 2 o'clock. That'll be really neat. That would be fun. Oh, Super my. cool, right? I can see you loving that, I was going to say, Laura and I should go take a class, see how... It, how how much powder we get, flour we get all over. There you go. Right, right. It Hashtag could be carbonation. Great or you know? terrible. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, going on all weekend, actually, also the uh, the Nashville Home Expo. It's right there at the fairgrounds, which would be really cool as well. So right. 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Definitely check that out. Uh, guys, happy Friday the 13th. I feel like we need to talk about it. I know. Are you guys superstitious? You guys had a black cat in here earlier from the catio well, cat lounge. I'm superstitious which is awesome. except for black cats because I love them. Okay, yes. fair enough. <laughs> yeah, you guys, we love black you guys cats. ready to learn about the history of superstitions? Yes. But yeah, I feel like on. we gotta uh, we gotta kind of make it officially the Friday the 13th. You guys ready? Oh, okay. Stand by. I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. okay here we go. <laughs> All right. Here he comes. <laughs> okay. Good thing oh, I'm so, so right. we're, we're gonna we're gonna prove that all superstitions aren't exactly bad. Ooh, okay. Okay. Right. So first I have to walk through it. I'm nervous for you, Joe. Oh. Okay. So far nothing bad has happened. So correct. Far. So far. All right. As so, it falls so, on us. So under a ladder, we're gonna learn about the history of superstitions. Bring it on. Okay. All right. Here we go. So why do you think that the number 13 is unlucky? Like, wh where do you think that originated from? Hmm. Oh, I have no idea. Hold Trying to get on. comfortable and Let cool me on think. this thing. The right? Someone right. died at that age or something? Well, actually, so it actually started like super back in the day. Judas, you guys know him from yeah. the Bible. Yes. Shout out to Jesus. Uh, Judas was actually the man who betrayed Jesus and was the 13th uh, guest at the Last Supper. Got it. So that's uh, where it started. Shout out to Jesus. Though. You yes. got to give it up for the big man. Yep. But here's the thing. Um, 13 also stems from a uh, an Italian expression that means hit the jackpot. So that's why yeah. a lot of people think that it's uh, it's actually good luck. So play the lottery today. Pick the number 13. Ooh. You actually might win. Mm. All right. I like that. Here we go. <clears throat> Moving on. Uh, now, one of the most common superstitions is like if you break a mirror, like you get bad luck for seven years. You yeah. guys know where that started from? I'm going to guess it's like vanity, like stop looking in the mirror, stop playing with the mirror kind of thing. Something or, with like Greek mythology because that's how the mirror was. Yeah. Okay. Ancient Romans believed that you can actually like see your soul in the mirror, but they also believe that every seven years your soul like regenerated. So if you shatter your mirror, you shatter your soul, take seven years to, uh, to get back. Oh, okay. This camera shot on you is... <laughs> Amazing. I mean, happy Friday the 13th. This is what we're doing here on Local One, too, sorry, right? Sorry. Um, all right, we're actually going to skip over one and we're going to head right to a good superstition. Okay. You Love guys it. ready okay. for this? Yes, okay, please, here we go. Bring it on. So, wishing on a shooting star has always been around. Like, you know, it's, it, it symbolizes good luck forever, right? Do you guys know where that came from? Where did that originate from? No. Laura? No? Uh, I mean, yes, it no? has Maybe to be so? some sort of like st uh, astronomer. Correct. Good job. Greek astronomers thought that flickering or flying stars were proof that the gods were spying on us. Oh. That carried over for generations to come, still holds up to good luck to this day. But here's the thing. So not all Friday the 13th are bad because all you got to do is find that shooting star, find that bright light. Right? And your lucky You're come a shooting true. star, Joe. Aww. Thanks, guys. Happy yeah. Friday the 13th. Happy Thank Friday you for the 13th. We love it. Love when you're here. Yes. Yay. Well, still to come.